the Mali Flot mellows and the melodic mixes and swift swings of various artists, especially that of Mayoknu Awodumila, artistically known as Meidi, like mollifications, melted the hearts of many in mesmerizing sequences of memorable moments. On Saturday, December 13, 2014, at the Idori Hills and Resorts, Idori Ondo State. The lively fields and effervescence were all at the celebration of the year 2014 edition of Mari Festival. Mari, meaning don't fall, is an international mountain climbing fiesta in Idori Ondo State. The festival debuted in 2009 and it celebrates the land, the people and its rich culture. The 2014 edition, just like that of previous years, featured various local and renowned artists with interesting displays to make the festival a memorable one. It began on Friday, December 12, 2014 with a flag of ceremony. Accompanied by the Director General, Nigeria Tourism Development Commission, Dr. Mises Saleh Mbanefu. The Ondo State Governor, Dr. Olushegu Mimiko, represented by his Chief of Staff, Dr. Kola Ademujimi, formerly flag of the festival and official launch of the Eden Hills and Resort and the Habitat One Tourism Zone in the Sunshine State. At the Habitat One, which is a recreational park, guests and leisure seekers had a great time playing badminton and other games and also savoring the exquisite taste of local cuisine. Also remarkable was the showcasing of Koko, a major cash crop in Ondo State. The paramount ruler of the Healy town, the Owa of Idori, Oba Frederick Aruloye, welcomed everyone to his kingdom, the land set on the hills. The Idori Hills Resort is a wonderful scenery. It boasts of facilities which are world class. All these were put in place without losing its natural aesthetics. All these were a marvel to everyone, including Dr. Sali Mbanefu, who couldn't help but savor with fervor the alluring nature in this sublime climb. An appreciative tour of the resort was undertaken by the enthusiastic entourage. There were cultural and musical performances by different groups. Dr. Sali Mbanefu in her address congratulated the Ondo State Governor for a job well done in tourism development in the state. I'm really, really, really impressed. I am just blown away. I mean, I was here just one year ago, and the change, you have a resort now. As a symbol of peace, pigeons were released. At the spelling of Idori, the special cake was cut. In his keynote address, the Ondo State Governor, Dr. Olusha Mimiko, ably represented by his chief of staff, Dr. Kola Ademujimi, reiterated the government's desire to harness Ondo State's cultural and tourism potentials. The next day, it was a galore of entertainment all through the night as guests trooped to the resort in their thousands to have fun-filled times as various artists thrilled everyone in the morning of Sunday, December 14th. From solo to group performances, Series of local musicians entertain everyone to refreshing renditions of sweet songs. Various displays by cultural troops spiced up the event. Also adding color to the event was the presence of a couple of top Nollywood stars. All through the party, there was no dull moment. The mood around the resort became turbocharged when one of the star artists, Iledari Oluwajuwolo, aka J1, stormed the stage and began thrilling all. <laughs> Dr. Olushegu Mimiko presented gifts to winners in all categories of the various Mari Festival contests. 
He also presented awards to winners of the Governor's Cup Golf Championship in appreciation of his contributions to the development of golf through the sponsorship of the Governor's Cup Golf Championship. Chief Michael Adilju, Chairman Elisa De Matos, sent an award to Governor Olusha Gumimiku. In his speech, the Governor promised to make Ondo State the best tourist destination in the country. This is the realization of our dream to make Ondo State the number one tourist destination in Nigeria. <laughs> From the Red Carpet TV crew, we congratulate the Ondo State Government.